I'm going to do the, oh, sorry, wrong sheet. Uh, I'm going to do the rest of the examples from the first sheet. So there's 2x plus 1. We already identified u as x squared plus x plus 7. Now I'm going to skip the actually calculating du dx step. And I'm going to go right to here and say du is equal to 2x plus 1 dx. And again, to see how I got that, looking back at the first sheet we did, we're looking at this problem right here. u is equal to this, du dx, 2x plus 1 and then I cross multiplied by the dx. So I just skipped that step. And I'm going to do that from now on out. So, but what do I do? Here, I'm going to differentiate that. There's my u. So I get 2x plus 1 over u to the fifth dx. I need to get rid of all the x's, so I need to get rid of that term. 2x plus 1 dx, well, that's right here. So I can just substitute that in. So I get du over u to the 5. Remember that you want to write your exponents on the top rather than in the denominator. And now it's just a simple integration. I get u to the minus 5 plus 1, which is minus 4. Again, it's easy to write this as minus 6. Don't do that. And so I get minus 1 over 4 times u to the minus 4 plus c. Here's my u. So I get minus 1 fourth x squared plus x plus 7 to the power of minus 4. Oh, these are all equal, sorry. And that's my answer. That's all it is. Okay. Same thing over here u is the exponent, du is going to be 2x dx, and now I start work, start working. So there's my u, okay, let me box that off, well, I'm going to gather all my x terms, so I get e to the ux dx, need to get rid of x dx, that's right here, same thing. So this tells me that 1 half du is equal to x dx. So now I can substitute that right into here. I'm going to take out the 1 half. And now I can integrate. Move that up here, that's going to be 1 half e to the u, the integral of e to the u is e to the u plus c. Now I'll substitute back in, look for my u, it's x squared plus 1. And I could write my answer this way, or I could write it this way. It doesn't matter. Either way is fine. Okay. So again, I'll do the last one. And if you're getting the hang of this, feel free just to go right to the homework. So again, here's my u u is 2x squared minus 1, that's what's inside the radical. du is 4x dx. Now looking ahead, here's an x dx. I'm going to have to substitute for that. So what I'm going to do is just do that work right now. So I will solve for x dx and I get 1 quarter du is x dx. Okay, again, I'll go through the steps. That's my u. I'm going to gather my x terms. Write my radical as an exponent. I've already solved for x dx. Take the 1 fourth out. and integrate. Oops, how did I get that? Looking at the wrong problem. Again, let's do the problem I'm supposed to be doing. Take the 1 quarter out. u to the 1 half. du. I'm, I'm sorry about that error. Integrate. 1 quarter. Add 1 to the exponent. Divide by the new exponent. Sorry, that's u. I don't know what, why I have that. Okay, 
sorry for those errors. Okay, now we're, now we're ready. So cross multiply, two thirds, one quarter, u to the three halves. Somebody forgot to turn off their cell phone. Get one six. And we're done. That's it. Okay. Thanks.